Welcome back to Sovina Everything guys. By the title of this video, you already know what I'm cooking today. You know when you're cooking something for the first time and you're hoping that it's gonna come out good and you have high expectations of it and then BAM! You hit it right on the money. That's exactly what happened to me today. I mean, you can tell by how much I'm smiling. I can't stop smiling. This was a total success. This lamb came out amazing and I cannot believe that it was cooked by me. All right, so anyway, let's get to the recipe. Let me show you exactly how I made this perfect lamb. Let's do it. We start off with the best lamb you can find. Here are all the ingredients I used for this recipe. Black pepper, salt, mustard powder, and rosemary. We start off by mixing all the ingredients together and making a rub. Here's how I butchered the leg of lamb. Make sure when you're applying the rub, apply a very heavy coat. Putting it in the vacuum bag was fairly easy and I did double bag this one. This lamb was cooked at 140 degrees Fahrenheit for 24 hours. Lamb's ready, let's check it out. Oh, it smells good, doesn't it? It smells like it's done right. It smells like it's good. Alright, so here's 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 the reason why I did this. Let's see if it works. See the bottom part right here? That This is why I did this. Let's see if it works. I'm going to remove the top layer part of the mustard and then we're going to sear it. So guys, the whole mustard thing is so that it would not taste so gamey. Okay, so we're gonna go outside and we're gonna sear this baby. Watch this. You know, these guys are making fun of me because I'm too excited by how amazing it looks. Doesn't it look great, Ninja? You have no words? Yeah, I'm anxious. You're anxious? I'm anxious. Everyone in the office is going insane saying this is ridiculous, looks so amazing. All right, let's cut it open. So juicy. Ah, oh, that looks so good, bro. It's it super so tender. It's super tender. It's falling apart. 
please give us your honest opinion. Wow. I've never done lamb. Please, I'm excited to find out the taste. I don't know, this is one of the best lambs I've ever ate. Really? Really. Give it a score. 10. 10? 10. It's crazy. Really good. It's all the way good. I'm too excited. I, sorry, I cannot stop smiling. You know, when you're cooking something and then you hope it turns out good and then you nailed it and you're like, you cannot stop smiling. That's what happened. That's what happened to me. Why did not stop eating, bro? I'm talking to the camera. That's what happened to me. I'm, I'm too excited. Oh so God. I apologize for my... Uh... Ninja, you have the lamp in there, but it's not really lamp. It's like, I don't know how to describe, bro. It's good. I want to try. I have never... The, the, the lamb flavor, you know, the worst problem with this is it's really gamey. Okay? It's tricky. It's tricky to really do gamey. Lamey. And, and what happened with this one is all the game went away. You have a really nice taste to lamb. Really soft, really juicy. And it's freaking amazing. I, I don't know how to explain it, man. It's, wow. you, can, you can feel the spices so much. It's, they are there, they have a good feeling on the tongue and all that, but what really hits you is a nice lamb flavor. Amazing. All right, I'm too excited. Now it's my mom's turn. Really soft. Tell us, mama, what does it taste like? Mm, it's like good lamb. Give it a score, mama. It's a 10. It's like, there's no gaminess to it. The only, like in the New Year's Day, it just tastes the lamb. The spices are just just enough to give it a hint of a flavor without overpowering anything. Ten, yeah, amazing. It's my turn. I gotta try it. Stop smiling, man. I can't stop smiling, bro. It's too exciting. I cannot believe I did that. Stop it. <laughs> I can't believe it. Alright, I'm gonna try it now. I need to concentrate. Oh my god. It's super good. It's not a little bit good. It's super good. There's zero gameness, like they said. The mustard did its job to take out the, the, all the gameness from it. Rosemary worked perfect. It's so tender, it, 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 you bite on it and it just melts in your mouth. Here's how I like to eat it. Grab a little bit of hummus, a little bit of tomato, a little bit of feta cheese, and we grab the star of the show. So we kind of make it kind of like a shawarma. You have to do this. It's not hard, it's easy. You have to do this. One of the best shawarmas I ever ate in my life. One of the best lambs I ever ate in my life. No, one of, no, it is the best lamb I ever ate in my life. It's amazing, guys. It's really good. Thank you so much for watching. We hope you enjoyed this video. And if you do, hit the thumbs up. That help us a lot. And if you're not a subscriber, subscribe so that you can watch our future videos. Thank you so much and we'll catch you on the next one. Bye-bye.